Hey, I'm Corey Anderson. We're here in Andover, South Dakota at the James Valley Threshing Show. Uh, I've got the 150 case out here in the plowing field, the road locomotive. It's the world's largest steam traction engine. Nine of them originally produced, none of them survived, and we brought this engine back to life completely from scratch, building it to the original case blueprints. And we're here in Andover today, and we're gonna make the largest plowing attempt that we've ever made with the 150 case. We're gonna pull 44 John Deere plows, 44 14 inch bottoms. So that's about three times what a normal tractor would be pulling this era. So the 150 case, as it sits right now, weighs in at about 35 tons. We've got a ton of coal, coal loaded on board. We've got 650 gallons of water on board. And we've got the plow hooked up behind. The plow is put together from a number of different sizes of John Deere plows. We just designed a hitch. Jim Bryden designed a hitch and engineered everything so that we can hook up a number of different plows. We've got a 14, 12 bottom, 10 bottom, 8 bottom, and a bunch of these plows all hooked together and we've got them linked together with these, these pipes to connect them and then we're pulling from these chains. So we're running a chain to pull central on every plow and then that each chain comes up to a central hook point on the engine. So each plow is actually pulled independently, just linked together, stabilized by the, the supporting pipes. So all of these plows put together, 44 bottoms at 14 inch plows, is, 50, is a 50 foot cut that we're gonna be making each pass. So we're turning over 50 feet of soil in one pass with this engine. So it's a significant amount of load and weight just the weight of the plows, plus when we get 20 people standing on them, is like basically like pulling a tractor pull sled in itself, let alone dropping the 44 bottoms in. So it's gonna be a significant drawbar pull. This engine at 180 PSI is capable of developing almost 8,000 foot pounds of torque. So we're gonna need all of that torque to get these plows drugged through the ground this afternoon. So let's take a look up on the engine. So this area right here is, is what we call the fireman's platform. So the fireman operates down here. He's got his two coal bunkers, one on each side. We've got about one and a half tons of coal capacity in each bunker. Directly underneath my feet is our water tank. We've got 650 gallons of water stored in this tank right here. And so the, the fireman, he manages the water, looking at the sight glass on the side of the boiler and then he's putting water in with these Penberthy steam injectors. So we've got two steam injectors to put water in the boiler. And then he's down here on one knee, shoveling, shoveling coal and feeding the beast. So that firebox is six feet long. And so it takes quite a few, quite a few shovels to get that thing leveled off and to make sure there's no holes in the fire. We don't want any cold air coming up through the fire but you also have to maintain a very even fire or you'll you'll snuff it out with smoke and, and, and you'll have a, you'll, you won't get enough heat out of the fire. So it's really an art to, to maintain the right fire. Up here is the operator's platform. So this is where the, the engineer operates the tractor. All of the controls are right here on the right side. So we got the power steering, the throttle forward and reverse, high speed clutch, low speed auxiliary transmission. And so the operator, everything is very convenient. Operates from right here. You can see the steam pressure. You can see the water on the other side and it has a good view. So we've got power steering on this tractor. So there's no steering wheel, one lever. One lever operates our power steering cone clutches and everything, everything is right here in one. So we are really excited. We're gonna, we're gonna have a very successful pull with this 44 bottom plow, we're certain, and we're excited to have you with us. Mighty one. 
150. Smell what I'm smelling. Turning and burning. Watch how far the drive will slide it over as it goes. I know, the front wheels are off the ground basically. She's a talking. Front end's a lot light. Hello, Mom Anderson. Hey. Look at that turning and burning. Making the dollars. All you, lady of steam, you with with child. Preaching the gospel today.
pulling her that way. We got our draft off by a little bit. Number two.
Amen.